Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today my video is a collaboration once again with Ohohu, but this time I will be reviewing three items. The first one is the liquid fine liners pen Kohala. This cool set has nine pens and each has different thickness. Ever since I found liners with different thickness, I've been loving it and it's great that Ohohu also has them now. The thickness on the lines of a drawing makes it more appealing to the eye and you can add detailing with other colors after and just use it as a guide. The liners are 003, 005, 01, 02, 03, 05, 06, 08 and B. That stands for the brush tip. Also very handy if instead you desire a more traditional stroke like the alcohol markers where we use the brush for painting. The pens have a very sleek design and they are very comfortable to use. The tips are exactly like the ones you usually see and this design is very handy because the ink just runs naturally. However, just a little tip, these pens do not work very well after using colored pencils. They are great to use with markers or other materials that do not have a shiny effect on the paper like the colored pencils. The second item Ohohu sent me was the gel ink pens that are my favorite part of the drawing. Adding the sparkles is the most magical part for me. This set has 12 pens, 6 are white, 3 silver and 3 gold. Having these pens in more quantity are always good because if you are like me, they end up pretty fast. However, I would love if this set had different thickness just like the liners we saw before. They are all 08 thickness, that is the normal and the most used, but I absolutely love to use thinner gel pens sometimes too, because it makes your little sparkles smaller, or you can have the number 10, that it's the biggest one, and you have big uh, strokes of white lines. So maybe ho oh, who can use this comment uh, something for the future? <laughs> Lastly, the last item is the Ohohu Colored Fine Line Pens. And this is what I really wanted to use so much. I already used other brands and it's so cool when you can add coloring in one step to your line art. Makes it more fun, appealing and colorful. These pens also came with a set of black pens, so it's pretty much the same like the first item I showed you. And then the Colored Line Pens are all with the same thickness of 05. A bit too thick for me because I always use my maximum 01 or 02, but I know that these colors only have this thickness in every brand. But maybe in the future, who knows, they can make more sets with different thickness. That would be great. But we will try to use them anyway and try to add fast strokes so it does not look as thick as they really are. I remember a drawing I had been lying around for a very long time on my sketchbook and the idea was to use the colored fine line pens. So this was the perfect drawing to use. While using I changed the pens and combined also with the black fine line pens. And as I expected, it went super well. This drawing worked also as a therapy for me because using many colors always makes me happy. Does it have the same effect on you? For the new people in my channel, welcome. I hope you enjoy my videos. If this is your first time and you are not subscribed, don't forget to like the video and also subscribe to the channel. And this character I'm drawing is my own character called Kiara. She is a nice and kind girl with black wings that loves to smile. I used my Copic markers to color her because I already know very well my colors for my character with the Copic because for many years I always used my Copic colors. Uh, maybe next time I will use the Ohohu, 
but as expected the liners did not bleed with the use of alcohol markers since it is prepared for it, but just in case you are wondering, you can use it with all mediums. You can use the colored pencils, you can use watercolor, you can also use any alcohol markers. You have many things that you can use, but when I told you that it does not work with the colored pencils, it's just if you want to use the liners on top of it, not before that. I hope you enjoy my little coloring. If you are wondering of who is that big creature on her legs, that is her friend Daiki. Over the years he grew, so he's a bit fat, and he has also wings. I guess Kiara do have a lot of story in my life. I created her when I went to DeviantArt and that is already over 10 years ago. But still, I still love to draw her and it always makes me happy because this is like, she's like a little part of me. It was nice to color some of the butterflies and the liners are almost exactly the same as the fine liners colors and the ones that are not I will fix later with my colored pencils. Something that uh, I don't see any artists tell you about is that when you use black liners and you want to use a light color to make just what I did here on the wings. So she has a little light on them and usually they blur. But in this case that did not happen. And you can see while I color the wings with the yellow first and then with the gray tones. So that's great. What's a good thing, because when you see that some things are getting blurred on your drawing and they're not supposed to, it's very sad. After the coloring done, I just did some little adds of black to her hair and then I used the white gel pen. So like I told you, this is my favorite part, I was so excited, as always. I absolutely love this design of the feather that you have on the pen, it's really beautiful. The white gel pen always works nicely with any kind of material, even the colored pencils, because being a gel, it just runs easily in all surfaces. And 
that's it. I hope you liked the result and a big shout out and thanks to Hohohu for sending me these lovely materials. I cannot wait to use it more and show you more of my creations. If you don't know what to get to your arty friend for Christmas, believe me, this would be a nice gift if you don't know what to get them. You can also find the links on the description below of all these items and usually Hohu has some discounts, so you just need to get them. Thank you so much for watching and have a lovely day. I hope to see you on my next video. Bye bye!